G'day from Australia. Are you ready to install the next generation of web connectivity technology? Entity Explosion is a new Chrome browser extension that, while browsing, lets you discover links and information about the same topic on other sites. This video is a brief introduction to show you around. So, let's start with a page you might be visiting about the Australian curiosity, the platypus. Now notice that the extension icon up on the top right has lit up red. It does this whenever the URL you are on matches a format pattern that is expected to have links. At this stage, to keep your browsing history private, it hasn't sent out any information, so we can't know for sure if we have connections until we click and send that URL off for more information. Within a fraction of a second, if we find a match to the identifier in the URL, the logo turns green and we're given this drop-down of information and links. All of this is drawn from a live query of Wikidata, which I think of as the Rosetta Stone of the Internet, because it tells us what every language and every site calls every entity. First, it gives us a few links to other Wikimedia sites in our language, including, of course, the Wikipedia page. Then, we get a bit of information about the platypus, including its taxonomic and conservation details and its lifespan. But if we then scroll down, there's even more good stuff. This is now showing us a whole lot of identifiers on other pages or in other databases, all specifically about the platypus. Let's try another example. Now we're on the Spotify page for an Australian musician, Jimmy Barnes, and the icon has lit up again. It's not just matching anyone called James Barnes. This will specifically match to exactly the right person. And this time around, I've set my language as Chinese. Wikidata knows about an awful lot of languages, so I really hope that this will be useful to you, whatever language you read in. So notice that all the information has been translated. And although there's no Chinese Wikipedia article yet, we get lots of information in Chinese and the link names are often translated as well. So, try it out. It works on people and places, organizations and organisms, everything from chemical structures to publications and so much more. Wikidata has almost no limits on what it describes, so Entity Explosion has potential to work for whatever you're interested in. So, how often will this thing light up? Even if you're not a big user of identifier databases, this will work on over 5,000 sites, and I'm sure you'll all use a few of them. So for anyone still around, here's the lowdown. It's free. It's open source. It automatically localizes to almost every language. It protects your privacy because the only time it sends a URL to the Wikidata query service is when you click the button and it is continually updated because the information is always live from Wikidata. So that's my offer to you. Please download it, give it a try and rate it so that your friends will see the value. Entity Explosion.